right, so you actually... No, I was in the forces. Yeah, of course. I mean, that, that makes more sense. Yeah, but, um, which force? Parcel force? Yeah, I have some respect. I mean, special forces. I'm correct, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. You must have some very interesting stories about clearing insurgent Talibans from the caves of Tora Bora. Well, with respect, I'm, I'm just here to talk about uh, survival in the outdoors. I'd rather than not go into counterinsurgency techniques or classified operations of any kind. <laughs> Specifically, not about the Tora Bora case. Okay, all right. I'm just very interested to hear about hand-to-hand uh, -hand combat, which I am told took place. Um, pretty ugly stuff, but I know sometimes. It... But okay, well let, let's let's talk hypothetically. Um, didn't say the caves don't necessarily have to be Tora Bora. So where are they then? Cheddar Gorge. So the Taliban <laughs> have come over to Cheddar Gorge. Not necessarily the Taliban. Could be a radicalised homegrown terrorist cell. Like the RSPB. I'm pretty sure that the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds is non-violent. At the moment, they're not violent, but what if we kicked it up a notch? Let's paint a scenario. The last osprey in Britain is killed by a football. The last osprey egg is stolen and scrambled for a Russian oligarch's breakfast who eats it without one iota of remorse in his leather jacket, <laughs> simply wipes his lips and says, Simples. <laughs> Where are you going with this? Bear with me. So, th so rare birds' eggs are being scrambled for Russian oligarchs, and Bill Oddie goes ape shit. <laughs> he shows up at Claridge's wearing his twitches jerkin, and the pockets are full of every conceivable explosive. I've got the picture. He walks in to the uh, buffet area, the breakfast buffet. Uh, people turn around. They say, "Isn't that a man from Spring Watch?" Someone else says. It wasn't, wasn't he once one of the goodies? <coughs> yeah, not anymore. Now he's a baddie. Seconds later, carnage. Oddy is like a bearded Catherine wheel siding through the crowd. Ironically, so the, the oligarchs wearing the leather jackets are protected from the worst of the blast, but a, an innocent couple from the northeast <laughs> on a city break are vaporised. <laughs> are you, are you